Hi my fabulous people out there, this is a magical reading for you. It's a two week reading and how I work, I use my own intuition with the cards I use. Um, I'll shuffle them for you and then I'll pick out the card what I feel is most relevant for you to help guide you. I am an artist, is my background, so that's how I visually interpret things. And I want to use this like special gift I have to help guide and inspire and advise you on your journey. So I work with the past, um, sorry, the present and the future. So going through the week to hopefully guide you throughout the week. So let's see what we get for you. The cards I use are going to be the Crystal Power Tarot cards. So that is these cards here. Where it shows you the traditional deck. But it uses the chakra colours and what crystal will be most relevant for you and help you as well. And this next deck I'll be using is the Art Oracle deck. Where it relates to an artist and then it tells you how to go forward with life, work and inspiration, like how to be inspired. Like I say, I will shuffle the cards and then use my own intuition on how I feel relevant to guide and advise you. And this deck here are colour cards. I've made these myself. As you can see on the back, it's got the chakra colours throughout the human body and the tree of life coming through. I do do artwork as well, like I say, and it's got different colours that will hopefully guide and help you by wearing these colours. It doesn't have to, you can wear them, it doesn't have to be like anything big like a jumper, it could be like socks or a little scrunchie in your hair or anything. And hopefully they will help with being on the same level as the universe and guiding you. So yeah, there are different colours of the chakra colours. So you've got green, yellow, indigo, violet, red, blue and orange. So there's seven of them here. Just checking, I haven't lost it. So I'll be picking you out a colour card as well. I've got my crystals right here and um, my light. Uh, so fire as well. So let's get going. Hi, my fabulous Libras. I hope you're doing amazing out there. Right, let's get going. I don't know why I said that really sarcastically. I didn't mean it sarcastically. I just felt like being sarcastic then. I don't know why. Right, so let's see what card we've got for you. Let's see what card we have for our fabulous Libras. King of Pentacles. I'm sure of my place in the world. So it's a king, so it's very masculine energy. Because um, obviously you have the queen and king. So yeah, masculine energy. You know what you're capable of. And I'm sure of my place in the world but you feel like you're still growing. I mean, he's got his third eye even like shining through there. So you're able to maybe have a spiritual connection as well. But as you can see, the vines are growing up him. So you feel like you're still growing. But the King of Pentacles, obviously with Pentacles, it does relate to money and that kind of side of things, but it can be as well wealth in a different way, wealth of having a wonderful family, having something that you feel you are um, wealthy in basically, it doesn't have to always be money. So think of that as well. See what artists we get. Have this artist right here. So for life, design your days, don't plan them. Okay, so it sounds like at the moment you're very into planning everything when sometimes you shouldn't. 
you should let you should look for you can say oh let's go here but don't plan it down to a t make sure you um let it flow a little bit because sometimes the best things will happen are things that happen by accident so it's good to plan stuff but don't have to plan it to exact moment because certain things will happen like for i don't know for fate reasons or reasons that you bump into someone or something might happen because you did not plan to go that way down that road you did not plan to do this or do that and something different happens our uh, work inspire to profound particularly inspire to profound particularly Okay, so maybe with work a bit, you need to focus into something a bit more. What's interesting, because obviously with your life, you need to let it flow a bit more. With work, you need to look at the certain things in it. Maybe you need to look at certain things in your work, what you want to focus on. Uh, inspiration be unbending in your flexibility okay so if you want to be doing something <laughs> if you want to be doing something or there's something you want to no I'm letting your flexibility if there's something that you believe I think before that right then make sure you keep believing that don't change that way just because someone else says a different thing I think that means of that one. Right, let's see what colour card we get for you. My fabulous Libras, we have got blue. Throat chakra. It symbolises self-expression. It expresses the truth, creative communication. Symbolises security, trust, loyal, responsible. And wear it to feel tranquil and serious, or serious. Affects, protects, calm, relax and support, support, sorry. Energy, competent, peace, honesty, reliable, um, uh, passive, uh, depressed, uh, protect, protectable. So obviously that is the negatives and positives that come with the colour. But I always look at the positives. So if you wear this colour, you will be on your higher level with yourself and able to take on board what is happening around you for these two weeks. And see you guys later.